Hey everybody, my name is Jay Moore and I am with The Ordinary Christian and I, I want to talk with you today about a really important subject on missional living. Uh, many of you are here today uh, who are Christians, you love Jesus, and you know you, that you're supposed to live a missional life. You, you know you're supposed to share Christ and shine the light of Christ. You're just not sure how to go about it. Uh, before I get started in my main topic of what I want to talk about, I just want to let you know about a resource that I have. They're called Missional Devotionals. I send them out weekly on Monday mornings to hundreds of people in the United States and around the world just to encourage them, provide that sense of encouragement uh, to, to live a missional life. And so I want to... Uh, encourage you to take a few moments at the end of this video and just go on down subscribe to it you'll be put on a mailing list you'll, you'll be emailed a, a video missional devotional that will perfectly hopefully encourage you to live that life of shining the light of Christ but today right now I want to share with you about uh, and answer an important question about what is the goal for missional living you know what what's the bottom line what are we trying to accomplish when we say live a missional life. I mean, there's a whole lot of talk about what missional living is all about. It's living a missionary lifestyle, you know, being the missionary in your community, in your neighborhood. And those are all good things. But when you break it all down, what's the purpose? What's the goal? What's the, the ultimate end that you're trying to accomplish by living a missional life? Well, Jesus, in Matthew chapter 28, at the very end of the chapter, he gives us what we have come to call the Great Commission. And in that, these are his last words that he gives to all of us before he ascends up into heaven to go sit at the right hand of the Father and, and wait for his return that he's going to come back one day. And he gives us this mission. Missional living, mission, this commission, you know, it all's together. This is... The bottom line, this is the goal for missional living, to fulfill the Great Commission. And he says in there, he says, All authority has been given to me in heaven and on earth, therefore go make disciples. Now that phrase, go make disciples, is written in the imperative mood, which is a command. Go make disciples is not an option. It's not just one of many things you can do. It is a command from Jesus who said he has all authority to give us this command. He's telling us, go make him more disciples. Baptize them in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Teach them to obey everything I've commanded you. And lo, I'm with you always, even to the end of the age. But at that, this one part here, it's so important for us to understand. Our goal in everything we do in missional living is simply to make more disciples for Jesus and help them grow to such a place in their life that they are reproducing disciple makers. Matter of fact, we are to produce not just disciples, but reproduce disciple makers. Help people come to faith in Christ. Help them to grow in their strength in Christ so that they are reproducing and making more disciples for Christ. Bottom line, if you're not you're not living a missional life, if you're not helping people come to faith in Christ and become reproducing disciple makers, that's your goal. That's your reason. So I'm just going to leave you with that. I want you to contemplate on that and ask yourself these important questions. How well does your life produce new disciples for Jesus? Do you even know how to? Do you know what you need to do to help people come to faith in Christ? Do you feel competent in that? Do you feel confident in doing that? If not, I encourage you to come and be a part of what we're doing with The Ordinary Christian because that's what we're here for. We're here to empower. We're here to encourage. We're here to equip Christians to live a missional life, effective missional life, where people truly become disciples, reproducing disciple makers for Christ. I'm glad that you joined us. Now, if you are a person who loves Jesus, you want to be a part of his mission, you, you, you just feel need like you feel like you need encouragement. Like I shared at the beginning of this video, there is a link right below here to start receiving free weekly missional devotionals. I want to encourage you to hit that link, fill out the information, give us your name, give us your email address, and you will start receiving via your email inbox these free devotionals from The Ordinary Christian. 
Here's my promise to you. Your email address will never be sold, will never be given away to any person or any group for any reason. It will be secure. So take a few moments right here, right now, hit the link, fill out the information, start receiving those devotionals. Take care. God bless you.